Eva, where do you think the elves went? Elves, where are you? Are they there? Hmm. You were here yesterday. Are they in your room, maybe? Good job, student. Oh, oh my. Cool. Ava, look. Look at it on your desk. Oh, look at it. That's pretty awesome, kid. For Ava. Love Ellen Alfonso. Oh my goodness, it's for you to color, Ava. Are you gonna say good morning to your elves? They must have known that you did so good with your schoolwork yesterday, Ava. I bet you they're proud of you. Oh, don't touch. But you can't touch them. Remember, you'll take their magic away. Wow. You say love you, elves. Hey guys, today is Vlogmas Day 4! Oh my gosh, I can't believe it's Vlogmas Day 4. However, I am so sorry about my inconsistent upload times. I've had some major technical issues or difficulties here, but that's okay. It put me in a bit of a grumpy mood, but I went outside and I'm feeling better. So Vlogmas Day 4, we're sticking close to home just like everybody else, but we have some schoolwork to do with Ava. Definitely I want to get outside because it is so beautiful here it's abnormally warm especially for december oh ava wants to go back outside and see the lights apparently and then later on today i think yeah i think today i might have a little bit of a pamper session for myself so i'll show you guys all the products that i'm going to use and then obviously stay tuned because i am going to have a mom tip for you and oh my gosh speaking of mom tip I need to get this hair done. Oh my goodness, I cannot wait. I'm getting my hair cut tomorrow. Thank goodness. Okay, guys, if you're new to my channel, my name is Angela, and I like to do videos on all things about motherhood, family, and lifestyle, and Vlogmas. So make sure you guys click that like and subscribe button down below, and also hit that notification bell. So it is abnormally warm where we live. Like, it says it's gonna be like 10 degrees. All of our snow's melting. Our skating rink, that if you saw, we were our skating rink is melting. Everything is melting. I think we might have a brown Christmas this year. Miss Muffet, are you coming? Come on. Her and her little purse. So we decided to head outside because mommy needed some fresh air and I'm really frustrated with technology. So I thought that I'd take you guys out with me. We've done homeschool already this morning for little Miss Muffet. I'm just here with Buster Brown and Ava. We're gonna get some fresh air, play outside for a little bit. Then I thought today that I would have a little bit of a self care day because quite frankly, gosh darn it, I need it. <laughs> I know we shouldn't have to like publicly announce I'm gonna have a self-care day, but you know what, I am. So I'm gonna have a bubble bath. I think I'm gonna read a little bit later on tonight. Kind of just shift my mindset. But yeah, I think I just need to take a deep breath, not get so worked up into the panic of December, the present buying of December. And that's okay. So I think today I'm gonna have a little bit of a pamper session and show you guys what I do. And then tomorrow I get my haircut, which I'm so glad about. Do you guys ever have that time when I think that I think that's why I'm in such a grumpy mood too. Cause I 
you just get to a point with your hair and there's just nothing else that you can do. So I'm gonna stop rambling on. If you're new to my channel, my name is Angela, and I like to do videos on all things about motherhood, family, and lifestyle. So make sure that you guys click that like and subscribe button down below, and also hit that bell for notifications. Okay, all right. Whoa! Video, I thought that I would show you guys a few new clothing items a few well quite a few new clothing items that I picked up for this little munchkin along the way she is just growing like a weed and I can't keep up with her also though this is your mom tip your mom tip is start getting your clothes and your outfits organized for Christmas now now I know that for this Christmas it probably is gonna look really different than we're all used to we're not going to as many parties. Well, we're not going to any parties, let's be honest. Zero parties, unless it's like cocktail parties on Zoom and you're fancy from the top up and then pajamas from the bottom. It's like a, a mullet, but clothing. So <laughs> I thought that I would get organized for what I want to wear and what Ava's going to be wearing for this Christmas. So I'm going to show you guys a little haul that I've done for her. I've decided that even if it's just going to be us three for Christmas, I think we're still gonna get dressed up at home. I have a couple outfits that are really pretty just in case we do end up seeing family. Fingers crossed, wouldn't that be lovely? Even if we don't end up seeing family, I still wanna take some lovely pictures of Little Miss Muffet all dressed up. I'm gonna show you guys some items that I've picked up for Little Miss Muffet that are for Christmas and then also around the house. I'm not gonna show you any clothes that I've picked up for myself right now because let's be honest, I'm not picking up that much. So I'm gonna start off with mm, Christmas Eve. I'm going to start off with Christmas Eve and a tradition that my mom started with me and it's my favorite tradition is Christmas Eve PJs. So Ava has quite a few Christmas pajamas in the rotation right now, but I put these aside and I'm saving these. These are from Carter's and it's that little Buffalo red and black check print, little top and pants here and I got these in the size six for her just because she is so tall these were $24 but I know that there's a sale going on right now for all those Christmas pajamas so I cannot wait to give these to her on Christmas Eve and get her all cozy and warm all right so these next two items are her dress up items for Christmas I found these both at winners and so this first is this I love these so beautiful much. little sweater dress and there is this cute little ruffle on the bottom. It came with tights and a headband with a little pom-pom on the bottom. The brand is Tahari. I think that's how you say it. I'll show you right there. The brand is Tahari. And this is in the size five to six years. And I love these little pearl details. I think she's just gonna be so comfortable in this no matter what. And the best part about it is the price. $29. This was $29 and I think it is so beautiful and this will also take her into the new year in case she has any birthday parties. Well, I'm talking about parties, who the heck knows? 
anyways I know she's gonna get good wear out of it and I know she's gonna be comfortable it's soft it's not scratchy there's not a crinoline and you know do you remember those days when our moms would dress us up and there'd be like a crinoline and it'd be so itchy and uncomfortable my little one's gonna be comfortable in this okay then the next thing that I got oops is for Christmas Day, and it's I this. I took the tag off. Did you? I did. Well, oh, she took the tag off. It's for Christmas Day, and again, Cause, cause it's really this good. little sweater dress with a skirt. And look at how cute this skirt is with this cable knit print and then a cute little gray sweater. And there's like a silver thread running through it. And then it came with little earmuffs with little earmuffs and this was a little bit pricier this one was $34 again same brand oh no it's not the same brand this is cupcakes and cashmere and it's a size five to six oh, years I know she is going to absolutely love this and I know we're gonna get the it's cutest the pictures in this my mother-in-law started doing this for Ava I think when she was one I know she's only three now when she was one and for her first Christmas she bought her a red jacket and it was so beautiful so again I found this is at winners and there was one of them so I knew it was a sign so I grabbed it and picked it up right away look at this little red jacket it is so beautiful with a little ruffle around it and these little snap buttons the brand for this is tailored by Rothschild. And this is in the size six. And how much was this? And this was $40 and it fits her so well because there's room to grow, which is why I picked this up. And it's a little A-line cut. I love this. She looks darling. She reminds me of Princess Charlotte. I love the royal family. So as soon as I saw this, I was like, oh, I could see Princess Charlotte wearing this. And my little princess, I know, is going to look just as cute. Okay, so those are kind of Ava's Christmas day, Christmas Eve, fancy, fancy outfits. Okay, so now I'm going to show you a haul. I went to Carter's again because Ava seems to be fitting Carter's really well, which is surprising because when she was a little one, She's still a little one. But when she was a baby, Carter's just didn't fit her great. But now that she's going into the bigger sizes, she's roughly a size five or a six. They're starting to fit her oh, really five well. five and six. The outfit that Ava's wearing right now, I'll show you guys in a minute. It's so cute because I love Carter's because it comes in sets. So it came with a pair of leggings and a sweater. Can you see this here? So it's this cute little red A-line tunic sweater with these little leggings with hearts all over that. them. So I'll show you guys that in a minute, but so cute and it fits her so well. And that's what I love about Carter's that it makes it easy for you. Then I got these kind of waffle thermal liners, especially for wearing like under overalls or under fleece jackets. So this little lilac one, it has little polka dots, you know me and polka dots all over it. And this is so sweet. And then I got another one in navy blue with little colored hearts all over it. And then I got the same in a pink. It's a pink with like a oh, kind of an orangey stripe through it. I don't know if the camera will pick that up there. But I know that she's gonna get a lot of wear out of these. I know this will keep her warm and it's a great little layering piece. Okay, now this next outfit is too big for her. But that's totally fine because I know that she'll grow into it eventually. This is a size seven. But do you know why I couldn't resist it? Those polka dots and this little bow is so sweet. Now this was $28 for this set, but everything in the store was at least 30 to 50% off. So I stocked up. I know she'll grow into this. Even by next fall, she'll probably grow into this and that'll be perfect. A leggings and a little sweater set, super cute. Okay, the next thing, I've had my eye on this for a while. I really like fleeces that Ava can throw on if she wants to run outside and it's not too cold out. Right now, this is the perfect little pullover. It's a nice navy blue fleece lined, and it's actually Sherpa lined pullover with these cute little light pink hearts. It's so sweet. Again, this is the size six. Okay, then... I got her this little sweater with this 
turtleneck and there's a navy blue kind of like a forest green a light blue purple gold and a pink stripe thread and this was $32 but I know that this was 40% off okay now I love Ava in buffalo check and I love her in tunics look at how cute this little tunic is this little peplum bottom and the little bow detail so cute size 6 this was 50% off so regular $22 50% off yes please oh my gosh my polka dot obsession is getting out of control <laughs> look at this little set so this again is size 6 and it came with these cute bright red leggings it actually reminds me of 101 dalmatians so maybe she can go as a dalmatian next year for halloween and just wear this outfit <laughs> anyways so this cute little outfit came with this oh come on get in there came with this cute little peplum top this is 28 dollars, and i know that this was 40 percent off Okay, and then the last item that I picked up was not from Carter's. It actually was from Costco. Costco has the best sweatsuits, and Ava always fits them really well, especially these Puma sweatsuits. So let me show you guys, because I just thought it was so stylish. Now, I have to call my mother-in-law because she's so kind and so sweet and so generous but she always goes to costco and stocks up on sweatsuits for ava so i'm like don't pick up the black and pink one because i know that she already bought one and she did she got it in the gray so i'm glad i got this black sweatsuit with this neon pink and this is puma so stylish and i love this fluorescent pink i thought that is so cute and so stylish on her this is a size six and then again the black Puma sweatpants with the neon pink drawstring, neon pink logo, and this was size six as well. And I know that she's gonna get so much wear out of this. Hey, we're hanging around home. How perfect is this gonna be? Like in between Christmas and New Year's, we just wanna snuggle up and watch movies all day. So that's my little haul of outfits for Ava. I think that she is fully stocked and good at least till March, at least till the spring. I'm not going to worry about her at all. And no, we're covered for Christmas. So mom tip, remember, start getting your kids clothes organized now. Get those Christmas pajamas already. They're running out of sizes I've noticed in stores. I even saw some like Valentine's Day clothes out there. That's too soon. Come on, we're not even at Christmas yet. So run out to the stores, moms and dads, grandparents, stock up on those Christmas jammies, stock up on your little Christmas outfits if that's really what you wanna do. Or maybe you're just gonna hang out in pajamas all day. Which, you know what, I'm probably gonna get a picture of Ava in that little dress and then we'll go back into pajamas. Cause let's be honest, 2020. Okay, so coming up in the next few videos, I think I'll do a little bit of a clothing haul of some items that I've picked up for myself along the way because I wanna be comfy and cozy too this Christmas. Okay, on with the video. Eva, how exciting is this? Five. <gasps> it's five? That yeah. means it's pretty exciting. Five is Ava's favorite number. And we gonna do the hockey rink. Rest this, rest this. Well, not tonight though, right? But maybe on the weekend you can shoot some pucks with dad. Oh, you gotta use two hands. Easy go. Either go this way. Okay, that's how daddy shoots. Or you go this way. This way. Do you want to try it the other way? Yeah. See? And then that's, that's a different way. Good holding! Do you like that way? Oh crap, I gotta teach you right hand. Every can <laughs> Every Canadian's right of passion. Uh, hey, are you a Canadian now? Which way? Watch the walls. Yeah. <laughs> this way. This way feels better? Okay, that sucks for daddy. But... Whoa! Good job, kid. Ava, that was really good. Okay, let's see it for outside. Wow. We are just gonna settle in and watch a little bit of a movie. Before we start, I just wanted to give you another mom tip, and that's to have grace with yourself and be kind to yourself. This Christmas is really different, and today I found myself in a little bit of a funk. No, not a little bit, a big funk today. And putting pressure on myself, pressure even about Vlogmas already, that my internet wasn't working and it was taking me forever to upload my video, and then started beating myself up about 
Christmas presents and <clears throat> not having enough prepared and what are we gonna do and seeing fam and I started to get like wrapped up into a tizzy and it's not helpful for anybody and I've already broken my own promise to myself that I was gonna have a calm and simple and fun Christmas so have grace with yourself it's okay if your budget isn't as big as it was last year right here it's okay if you have to cut down your Christmas list it's okay if you can't send out Christmas cards. It's okay if everything doesn't go to plan. It's okay. As long as I have my little Ava here and Merrick and we have our lovely home, that's all we really need. And I just need to keep reminding myself that- And we go have hot chocolate. Yeah, and we have hot chocolate. So be kind to yourself, give yourself grace. This year is a different year, so no rules apply. Nothing is the same as it has ever been before. This year is a total write-off, so just relax, Angie. I'm talking to my future self. Relax, Angie. Be kind, give yourself grace. Moms, you all know that you create the magic around Christmas, so it's okay if you need to take a little step back, take a breather, and take care of yourself. Tomorrow is a new day, and I'm excited for tomorrow. What is this? What, what did Daddy make you? Hot chocolate. It's hot chocolate with whipped cream and? Sprinkles. Are you a lucky little lady? Yep. You say thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Oh my goodness. Okay, be careful. Mommy tried before. Best daddy in the world. Sure. Mommy for sure has to try it. It's too hot. Are you sure that she has to have it? You have your own. <gasps> Record my belly. Thank you. Thanks, babe. <gasps> Try it. See you better. Oh, babe. Cheers, baby. No, oh, you have your own. I want to try yours. Mir, you're like a master hot chocolate maker. Well, the milk makes all the difference. It's delicious. Can you try it. Milk. Mm. I'm ready for bed. What is that saying? And mama in her kerchief and I in my cap had just settled our brains for a long winter's nap. That's what I need. Sleep. I'll try yours. So I have been waiting for this all day long and sometimes when I'm in a bit of a funk or I just feel like I need to calm down and relax, I like to have a bath. Baths are like my number one self-care thing. So I'm gonna draw myself a really nice hot bath. I want it really steaming hot. And so I'm just gonna show you a couple of the things that I have for me. So I'm gonna do a sheet mask and I love the Body Shop's sheet mask. I use the Body Shop um, facial care anyways and skin cleansers I use our tea tree oil line but my skin's feeling really dull so I think I'm gonna go for this I'm gonna go for the body shop vitamin C glow sheet mask I think I just need some brightening then whenever I'm in the bath I always catch up on my YouTube so for sure Zoella's vlogmas is at the top of my list for bubble bath, I have this Rocky Mountain Soap Company, the Better Bubble Bath. This smells so nice. Calming lavender, yes please. Then I also have this Sugar Scrub from the Rocky Mountain Soap Company. A bath bomb from the Rocky Mountain Soap Company. And I think I am in for a treat and to go along with that bath besides Ava's toys. <laughs> 
<laughs> I'm also gonna have a glass of wine. But yeah, let's be honest. Moms, we all know. Yeah, bath toys. Alright guys, so I am going to call it a night here. Thank you so much for watching and I cannot tell you how appreciative I am of all of you for subscribing to Little Old Me and tuning in and watching all of my family's adventures. I love you guys so much. I love all your comments. Please keep commenting. I love getting to know you. It is such a treat and I love doing this. So hit that subscribe button and also turn on your notification bell because I promise you I'll get better at uploading for Vlogmas. Hopefully, look at my mascara. Hopefully I'll sort out my internet issues, but I love you guys so much. I hope you're enjoying our Christmas activities. I promise you we have a lot coming up. Okay, it's time to get in this bath. I'll see you guys for Vlogmas Day. Bye!